Top 10 Fascinating Facts About Siamese Cats Today we will talk about a cute animal that is basically the descendant of tigers. Yeah, tigers. Exactly. Scary, right? Well, I wouldn't necessarily call it scary because these cutie pies are anything but scary. Yes, I'm talking about cats. Cats are cuddly. Cats are adorable. Cats are the cutest. I think everybody can agree on that, but there's one breed of cat that I want to talk about. Hey everybody, welcome to Paw Venue. The Siamese Cats. They are one of the first distinctly recognized breeds of Asian cats. They are fluffy cute and have the most beautiful eyes of the breeds. They are one of the most domesticated cats around the globe, and there's much more to discuss about them. But before we get started, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon to get updated about the upcoming videos. With all that being said, let's go ahead and continue with the video. A little overview of Siamese cats. Siamese cats are known for their different appearances. Most of the breeds have the usual silver gray color, but they can be an orange, brown, cream, and even blue color. These cats are loved and adored throughout the world. Their blue eyes are the most prominent feature of their tiny stature. The color depends on their genetics and the temperature of their surroundings. These cats are social, affectionate, and clever animals that are one of the most talkative breeds out there. They are loyal and loved by their owners because they respond to specific human calls. So what I'm trying to say is that these cats have a lot to discuss about. So let's discuss some. Number one, coat coloring. These cats have a variety of colors, but genetics is the only reason for that. So grab yourselves a lab coat because we are about to head into a little bit of biology. The color is because of the genes, obviously, but the different patterns are due to a modifier gene. So what happens is that the modifier gene basically doesn't allow the pigment in the fur to develop, which causes albinism in these cats. But glad that the gene comes into work when there is a slight temperature change. When the temperature gets below 100 degrees, the gene defect turns back on and carries the pigment on the fur. That's where this adorable gets all her colors. Number two, an old breed. As I have already mentioned, the Siamese cat is one of the world's oldest breeds. Legends say this breed originated around the 14th century in Thailand, where they first appeared in Thai manuscripts. Insane, I know. That's how old these guys are. So if they're running around the house and someone says, oh, they're cute, you get to tell them that they're 500 years old. It's an ancient breed, but look at how colorful and adorable little creatures they are. And they get along pretty well with the children and the elderly. So that again is a plus. I would definitely get this cat if I ever have enough money. Number three, common traits. Well, if you've ever seen a Siamese breed, you'd agree that most of them out there are cross-eyed and have a different sort of tail. But that again is because of that genetic thing. Legends are there that explain these weird appearances. One says that these cats were once guards of a golden royal goblet. While being the guards, they were constantly staring at the goblet. Because of the constant staring at the center of the goblet, they became cross-eyed. And because they wrapped their tail around the goblet for extra security, their tail became bent. Weird, I know. But cross-eyed cats were not liked by the people, so they were bred out immediately and had their defect removed. Number four, royal treatment. Since the legend said that these cats originated in Thailand, many royal families had these cats. They were adored and pampered. They were considered beautiful because of their unique and attractive appearance. The legend says that the royal families believed that these cats carried their souls when they died. Freaky, right? So, because of the fact that these cats had the soul of the royal families, they were taken good care of and adored by the priests and monks of the temple. Not bad, right? Even now, the families take great care of these cats not because of the legend, of course, but because they're so adorable. Number 5. Presidential Cats now, Thailand had these cats almost 500 years ago, but this cat came into the US in the late 1800s. And in the US also, this little princess was owned by US President Rutherford B. Hayes' wife, Lucy. She was one of the earliest owners of this cat in the United States. Now that again makes this cat a little princess, an important breed, because she was famous in the White House too. Her cat name, Siam, was gifted by the United States diplomat of Thailand. Even presidents like these cats. They are what you might call royal cats because of their history worldwide. Number six, movie star cats. Yes, these cats have starred big time in movies as well. Siamese cats appeared in films such as The Incredible Journey, The Lady and the Tramp, and That Darn Cat. In fact, the entire plot of That Darn Cat revolves around a Siamese named DC, or Darn Cat, who assists in the rescue of a child. 
Two real-life Siamese cats helped avert espionage in the 1960s, while DC from That Darn Cat helped prevent a fictional kidnapping. When two Siamese cats in the Dutch embassy in Moscow, Russia, began scratching at a wall, their owner assumed they were reacting to a disturbance that was not audible to the human ear. 30 tiny microphones were discovered behind the wall, proving his point. So these are detectives as well. As weird as it sounds, it's all true. Number seven, a talkative breed. Now, these guys are way too talkative. If some of you have one of these and you have spent some time with it, you know how these guys are. They react to their food and the warm feeling of your hand. If they are in a window and see something happening, they would respond in a certain way. Siamese cats are more likely than other cats to seek attention. New cat owners should be aware of the high level of care and attention their pets require. They may cry to get your attention because they are sad or want to interact with you. They basically are tiny humans that can see and react to what they see. Their meow can tell you what is going on around her. If it's normal, she will keep quiet. And if it's not, she will hiss. And her voice becomes more and more shrill. And you can guess that something is wrong out there. Number eight, appearance in cat shows. Cat shows happen all over the globe. But these cats were one of the first ones to start this. According to some reports, Siamese cats were reportedly displayed at the world's first major cat exhibition, a national competition held in London's Crystal Palace in July 1871. According to reports, it was the first time anyone in England had ever seen a Siamese cat. Soft, fawn-colored creatures with jet black legs, an unnatural, nightmarish kind of cat, distinct and lovely in their silky skins, with ears tipped with black, and blue eyes with red pupils, according to Harper's Weekly. On the other hand, other historians contend that the dark-tipped cats mentioned by witnesses were not actual Siamese cats and that the breed did not arrive in England until much later. However, all sides agreed that British Consul General Owen Gould brought two Siamese cats from Thailand, Pha and Mia, to London in 1894. The couple had kittens, and the cat family was shown at the 1895 Crystal Palace Cat Show. Number nine, world's fattest cat. Now, nobody wants their cat to eat so much that the Guinness World Records have to step in and call someone's cat the fattest cat in the world. Even the Guinness doesn't allow these sorts of records because they don't want to endorse making cats fat. But having said that, a Siamese cat named Katie could have easily won this title in 2003. This cat was from Asbest, a Russian city in the Ural Mountains. She was given hormones to stop her from mating, which increased her appetite. She ballooned to 50 pounds. While a typical Siamese male is 11 to 15 pounds and a female is eight to 12 pounds. Number 10, giving birth to 19 kittens. Now this cat, like all cats, can give birth to multiple kittens, but 19 kittens, really? A Burmese Siamese cat in Oxfordshire, England gave birth to 19 kittens on August 7th, 1970. Unfortunately, four of the babies were stillborn. According to the Guinness World Records, Siamese cats often have four to six kittens. This gigantic brood was formerly thought to be the world's largest litter of domestic cats, and it still is. Now that's a lot of kittens. These guys are always up to something, and giving birth to children is one of them. So guys, this is all about it. We worked so hard on this, so I hope you liked this video and let me know if you have any queries in the comment section. Also, do let us know if you're interested in getting a Siamese. Don't forget to give a thumbs up to the video and share it with your friends. Check out this playlist of latest uploads and I'll see you in the next video. Take care.